Hello, and thank you so much. Eric here. Thank you so much for purchasing the patch from Patch Foundry. I'm just going to walk you today through how to load this patch onto your Nord Stage 3. Let's start off by locating the download that you should have gotten when you bought the patch. So really quickly here, I'm going to go down to my downloads. Uh, usually your down or anything you download off the internet will go into this folder called downloads. You can usually find it in a shortcut at the bottom of your screen. If it's not here, just tap in the middle of your screen, use your uh, computer keyboard to hit Command N and go to Downloads and it should be right on the top of your list on if it's organized by date added. So I'm going to grab this, I'll drag it onto my desktop so I can find it easily and I'm going to close this window. Then I'll double tap to unzip this. We zip it in order to make it slightly smaller in download and it should just automatically unzip like that and create a folder. Move the folder over here, grab this and drag it into my trash because I don't need it anymore and I'll delete that later. Then I'm going to double tap on the folder. Now inside the folder there are three items. We have a bundle file which I'll explain in a minute, a patch file, and then a patch notes. The patch note is just a simple text edit document that I'm going to double tab. And then I'm going to go here and show you a few of the things I've included. For starters, every single patch that I have available on the website that's specifically for a song has a tutorial for it. This one's listed here. There will also be how to load this patch into Nord Stage 3. This video that you're watching, there will be a link to it here in just a moment. And then the next thing that's really important is getting Nord's free sound manager. And that's a piece of software Nord Keyboards offers. I'll show you how to get that. We're just going to copy this here. Command C on your keyboard. Come down to Safari. I'm going to paste and hit return. And there we go. So this is the software Nord offers for free that works with your Nord Stage 3. It also works with Electro 6 and Piano 4 and Piano 3 and a bunch of other pieces of stuff that they do. Um, you just click here to download it. If this page may change, I'm sure it'll be very obvious where to, to get it. Um, it downloads so fast and it will then show up like this in your um, bottom bottom bar here. And I'm going to just tap on it, it'll launch, and it should look like this. So these are all of the different patches that I have in my Nord stage at the moment. I'm going to go up very quickly here and we're going to get to an empty bank and load in the patch that you purchased. So I'm going to tap on Bank All and instead of it looks like Bank A has stuff, B has stuff, C has stuff, but Bank D is open. So I'm going to tap on Bank D. Now as you can see there are no lines like there were in the previous one because there's no patches set. In order to load in the patches we want to load we'll need to tap on the Organize button. This will allow us to move stuff around and see what slots they're loaded in and all of that. Now that we've done that, I'm going to go back to my folder, double tap, and there are two different items that are included in every patch. We have a bundle file, which bundles the sounds, not only, like the samples and sounds, and the patch file into one overarching document that you can drag in. And then we also have a patch file, which only is the patch itself, meaning there are no samples included here, which is why this one is half a megabyte, a little bit more than that, and this one is 12.5. Um, my personal preference is to use a patch file because I already have most of the sounds that I've designed with loaded into my Nord. Now, um, what 
if you don't want to mess with that or with downloading various things in order to get the right sounds, you can just drag in this bundle. If you decide to go the patch file route, which will save some space for you, if you go to patch notes, the sounds that I've used that are not already uh, like stock things like uh, oscillators or organs, uh, which don't need any sound to be downloaded into, um, that will be listed here. So for instance, in the Uptown Funk patch, the only patch I have listed here that is not, uh, that we would need to load in would be the in the piano section, you need to download the EP4 MK5 80s electric piano. And I've even included a handy dandy link that will bring up the exact patch you need to download. It will also allow you to download either the small version or the large version, which is handy on most of these. So you'll get the same sound in the patch, but you can potentially make it a little bit smaller if you want. I'm going to close this and hide it. And I'll show you really quickly here both options. So the first one is the bundle file. I'm going to just drag this in. We're going to drop it on to the location 11 and bank D. Let go. And then this will download the programs in the bundle. And then let's see, say add to bank. And I'll say yes. And I don't want to replace it. And then I'll hit download. And that downloaded very quickly because I already have the patch or some of the samples in here. So it may be a little slower on your side. Um, to get rid of it, all you have to do is just tap on it, and I'm going to press the delete button on my computer keyboard. And then make sure you want to delete it. Yes. So that's the bundle. The patch file will be like this. I'll drop it in, and that one automatically drops in. Now, if for some reason I haven't downloaded some of the content for this, like say I'm missing the uh, the electric piano, there will be a little note that said not found uh, electric piano, blah, 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 and it'll tell you the exact one. In that case, you could always go back to your patch info and download the sample. Um, a couple really important notes. As of version 7.44 of the Nord Sound Manager, it is not possible to edit or select patches here without your Nord Stage 3 being plugged into your computer. So if for some reason you can't get these patches to work, that's the most likely cause. Another potential cause of this is that you're using a Nord Stage 2 or 2EX or Nord Stage or Nord Stage EX. All of those are unsupported because uh, Nord drastically changed the way they do their patch structure in the Nord Stage 3. Sorry guys, it's just the way it is. Um, if you have any other questions, you're always welcome to reach out to me. I try and get back with people in about 48 to 72 hours, but sometimes it can be a little longer because I'm a full-time touring musician and uh, occasionally I am not available. But that said, I'd love to hear from you. I'd love to hear any thoughts you have. Thanks for watching. Good luck.